Yo, what up guys? So I'm, I'm out here in, in the Nike store in East LA, Whittier. And this is where the Jordan event is. There's like a, there's a basketball game going on outside. There's some food trucks. Um, and there's some heat in here. I just want to see. It says Space Jam 11's in my size. It's full retail, but you know you can't complain. This is this is dope, man. Donnie Boy's not here yet because he's late. Motherfucker's always late. Goddamn. But um, so yeah, there's some there's some really dope stuff here. I don't know why because uh, there's like a Jordan like display, and we'll we'll show you guys like all that stuff after. I'm just waiting for Donnie Boy to come. So, um, but yeah, this, I'm. Should I cop this? I de I'm probably definitely gonna cop this, but I already spent a lot of money, so we'll see, we'll see. This up? guy. What'd you get? He just came. Hey, hey, look. Look at some grails, cause Jordan, okay, so I was talking to the employee. Yeah. And then she's like, since Jordan Brand is here, they gifted this store with some uh, dope ass shit. Right. You should know from that. You should know what it is. Space Jam 11s, Space Jam 11s, dude. 11s. Wow. They have a lot of heat in there. Where? So let's go in the middle. Oh, there, yeah, so we'll check it out. Yo, it's Lamarcus Aldridge. Yeah. It's LA, dude. Yeah. Lamarcus Aldridge is here. That's sick. Okay, so you got some uh, Jordan 11 Space Jams right here. You know, and then you got some Gatorade Sixes. You got a lot of Why Nots here. You got the Why Not here. You got the All Star. And then you got the two-way, which is dope. They have a lot of shit. I, I still can't believe that was Lamarcus Aldridge, man. That's dope. It's huge. Outlet or is it? Yeah, I think it's an outlet, but it's really big. Yeah, it's huge. Yeah, so you have, uh, I don't know what you got. You got some Soldier 11s. Let's What'd go over on this side. You got some Superflies. Um, and some, 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 some. You got some, uh, what else do you got? Nothing really. Got a lot of PGs here. US colorway. It's 20% off. Right. You got the employee rocking the gold toes. All right, so you got some Kobe AD mids for 120. You got a whole bunch. Some KD10 man, blackouts. Yeah. Oh man, these are nice. Yeah, they have your size too. They do. You got some LeBron 15 BHMs. Right. Or no, yeah, this is a BHM. Those are cool. Yep. You got some LeBron 14s, which is eh. You got some hyper dunks. All the premiums, the premium. or whatever. Yep. And that's about it. And then we're at Donnie Boy section. Got some Gatorade ones. Super nice leather though. Like yeah, really, really punk. Like that's crazy. I think that's like the nicest yeah. leather I've ever seen on the Jordan. But yeah, dude, it's super dope here. There's some 31s here. You got a lot of shit. You got some 31s. Um, or 31s, Kyrie threes, some blackout Kyrie threes. Uh, yeah, you got some Kobe AD NXTs. Oh, some Kyrie fours. I saw this guy with a uh, that took the Kyrie four BHMs. So I think I think it was here. Oh, I saw really? yeah, I saw him buying it. It was dope. The quality ones. Yeah. Right. Yo guys, it's Brandon Ingram. Brandon Ingram right there, guys. Yeah, so we're at the Adidas event. We just came in. We walked like a mile. And this dude just fucking walks over. Oh, okay. He's tall as shit, man. Alright, so I'm in line. Look at all these fucking people. And um, so it's a. This event should be called Wait in Line event because that's what we're doing. And so uh, what, what, what I'm in line for right now is for basically everything and you uh, you get this, you know, like this little bracelet thing. It's a scanner so you scan your bracelet and you enter a raffle and then you can win some shoes. Hopefully I can win some shit but... Who's that? Oh, it's Harden. Okay, well, well, we just saw Harden but I don't think you guys saw it on camera. I don't think I got him but yeah, I saw Harden. I saw Brandon Ingram, I saw a whole bunch of people. It's really dope, um, but I don't like the lines. There's a lot of people here, but you know. Uh, Donnie Boy already got his shit, um, but uh, we'll, we'll 
I'll see you guys in the warehouse. There's so many Yeezys here, guys. So many. Let's see. Let's 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 look for some shoes. Yeezys. More Yeezys. Uh, Pharrell Williams. More Yeezys. You got some Jordans though. Jordan Space Jam. Uh, more Yeezys over there. Lots of Yeezys. Another Yeezy over here. Oh my God. Got some off whites. All right, so I've been in line for like three hours now. No, it's been like 30 minutes, but. Uh, so here, here's what you scan. This is what you scan right here. So here's the scanner, and then you just put your scan right there. That's the bait. And they have a whole line of shit that you can get. It's really cool. All right, so we're in the line for the warehouse. And they give you a tour of like 4D and stuff. It's really cool. But here's the line. And then you go from this line to another line that's over there. So it's it's pretty crazy. And it's so we were gonna wait in that line. So we know the homie, the homie Aaron, he actually uh, put this, he, Shout event, out to Aaron. he runs this, he put it together. Yeah, he, he, he put this event together, so he's like, what are you guys doing in line? So we, we got to like skip the whole line, but uh, there's something that's going on in there, so we have, we have to come back in like 10, 20 minutes. Yeah, uh, but, yeah so we're going we're gonna to see the warehouse tour uh, when we come back. So there's a few different things we should film. Uh, did you film the basketball court yet? Basketball court, you can check it out. It's a nice court. Can we go on it? Yeah, you can just walk on it. Really? Yeah. Yeah, you can just go on the court. There's no balls or anything. You guys gonna play? This game I like that. I know that. I know that. The conditions are not great. Very dusty. It's still sticking though. Swaggy P in the building, guys. Swaggy P. Swaggy P. Nick Young. What's up, bruh? That's dope. What is he wearing? So we're wearing some white three shit. I don't know. It's some white three stuff. All right, guys. Well, Dame's here. I don't know. It's, it's kind of hard to see. That's really hard to see. But Damien Lillard is here. And it's a, it's a mess all the way over there. So I don't think I can go. But and Alexander Wang is there. Oh, that's dope, dude. Oh, that's at the basketball. They're at the basketball court over there. Oh shit, that's dope. I do. Guys, hashtag, hashtag 747 Warehouse Street ST. That right there. You repeat after me, 747 Warehouse Street. 747 Warehouse Street. Perfect, perfect. So, this is the time crunch, we're just keeping it moving, right? So, try to stay with me. I'm going to be going fast in certain areas. That's a pop. <laughs> You have the cap for that, right? Yeah. So, the first EQT was designed in 1991. Here's what to start broadening the horizon, innovating the most important piece of equipment for athletes, which is, uh, excuse me, for athletes, which is a footwear. Who can tell me what EQT is for? Equipment. Oh. <laughs> I thought it was an acronym. <clears throat> Look at this EQT, guys. You see Donnie Boy's hop? Yeah, I tried to get it. <laughs> I couldn't really get it. It's dark. So we're inside this uh, haunted house. Yeah. I mean, I can't see you guys at all. You can't, huh? No, but I can, it's so cool in here. Take our time to hear it. I know. <laughs>
started using video equipment technology to be able to start tracking how fast and how athletes ran. And this allowed us to be able to develop a better performing shoe. So in this space, everywhere there's a spotlight, there's also a camera. So feel free to have fun with this. it up a little bit more and then they make it into these plastic pellets like that that's really cool and here's like a little you know Right, you see the patch bonds. The patch bonds is what literally sticks 
all the different patches on our shoes. So they're creating the 747 right now. They do about 18 and four minutes. He said, I'm getting the four Ds. I said, yeah, I'm on my way to go get him right now, too, dog. I, I thought he was telling the truth, too. But he lied to me. Aww. But yeah, dude, look at this shit. That's so sick, This is dude. crazy. That's dope, man. Yeah. I'm That's awesome. Wait, I want to see, like, Don't a try him on. Like, no, no, man. No? no. I feel like, dude, hold on, hold on. Dude, we'll put, wait, hold so on. We'll put down the tissue down. He doesn't even like it. <laughs> no. no, I haven't tried even like it. I feel so wait, like are you are Steve and I your security right now yeah, for this event? Yeah. yeah, they are. It's got to walk. It's like Matrix. It's got to walk in yeah. back to him. But yeah, dude, I got so lucky, man. Damn, that's uh, crazy. I, I also want the baits, but I ain't mad right now, dude. Yep. It's all the pickups. Donnie boy didn't get shit. No, I, I got yes, the BYWs. He did. I really wanted oh, those. Yeah, you did. You're in the car. I put them away. Yeah, I but... I wanted the 4Ds, but... Yeah, uh, what are you, 21 Savage? 21 Savage! He's on right now. Oh, he's on right now. We're hanging with the homie, Kellen Rowland, Mary yeah. Mouse, Julie. Oh, Whoop! Kellen's got a podcast. Tell us about it, Kellen. Oh, the Kellen Rowland going. Show. Yes. You can tune in anytime. Everybody knows about, about that show. Yes. That's what I'm talking about. Yeah. That's the homie right Lakers there. Lakers and... Life lessons. Are we so I could teach you what we can learn together. Let's go. Yeah. Are we gonna guess on that? Yeah. Oh, yeah, we're gonna get some. Yeah. yeah. We're, gonna some. Uh, we're gonna guess some. Yeah, yeah we're gonna dude. guess some. We're gonna guess some. We're gonna guess some. <laughs> <laughs> it's a guess. I'm sorry. Some. Yo, that's Kanye. Kanye West is here. No fucking way, dude. Jesus. Dude, that's a surprise guest performance, dude. That's Kanye. How y'all motherfuckers feel tonight? That's dope. I just came out here with my homie, my my brother right here, to introduce <laughs> to y'all tonight. I need y'all to make Look at some all these noise people for rushing, Chico. man. Kid Cuddy's coming out, guys. What's up? What's up? What's up? Kanye, let's go. <laughs> oh my god! Kanye! Everyone's running, look at that! Look at that shit! Oh my god! Alright, so I'm out here. Uh, Donnie Boy had to go home. Uh, he had to do some stuff so he couldn't make it. Um, but shout out to John. Um, you know, he invited me here and um, you should check out his page. I'll, I'll put the. The IG handle on. He makes, he has, he's a photographer, he makes some uh, really cool shots and shoes and stuff. Uh, but yeah, so I'm out here with Juice Brand, right? So they make uh, bracelets and they, they actually, if you guys know Kyrie, Kyrie Irving, you know, he actually reps Juice Brand a lot. And if you see like the slow mo replays, you can actually see like, you know, um, it's, uh, it's wristband. It's wristband, so. Uh, have some samples out here. So we got a triple black. It's a. I was gonna take this for Donnie Boy, but I feel like it's still a youth, right? Take it from him. Right? <laughs> this, this, one, this one will fit. Oh, this yeah, one. This one will probably fit him. This one will probably fit him. Yeah, yeah. right. So yeah, either one of those will fit him. Yeah. So that this, one stretches. So this one stretches. Okay. So this is a Deuce Brand logo. 
and basically, um, I'm not too familiar with the customization, so you can you can basically yeah. go, go through it. You can customize everything, like text, logo, colors, anything you want on the band. It's fully uh, fully customizable on, on the tie, right? Yeah, yeah. And we, and we have um, we have four different styles of bands. We have the premium band, uh -huh. which is uh, very different than anything that's on the market. This is like our first like cool band that we came out with. It's reversible, so you can wear it inside and outside. Uh -huh. It's got this cool little stretch component, and you can flip this badge. Oh, wow. So you can make it look different on any concept. So for example, this one here, uh -huh. you can see like you can have it, you can wear it this style, or you can flip it. So oh, essentially, I didn't know essentially that. with one wristband, oh, cool. you, get, you can get four different looks. Yeah. And then we have the 2.0, which you were holding in your hand. This is yeah, the right 2.0. And then we do, two, we do two different styles of baller bands, um, the 3 4 inch and a half inch. Uh -huh. And so that's that's kind of the four different styles we do right now. So what does Kyrie wear? Rock. Uh, this one, Kyrie right? currently is wearing this currently. on his currently. right wrist, uh -huh. and he's wearing one of these on his left wrist. Uh, so he likes the... But everything for him is customized to his logo and his... His, uh, what he, what he, what's saying he wants on the bench. Yeah, yeah. So when he hit the shot on Steph Curry for the championship, oh. it was this, it was this uh, design. It was this design? Yeah, that design. Really? So this exact color or just No, 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 this? no not that. We had a Cleveland Cavaliers for him. Oh, okay, okay, okay. okay. But his logo, had Kyrie's logo and then it was Cleveland Cavaliers. Color. Yeah. When he was playing with Cleveland. Uh huh. Now he obviously wears Boston. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But anyways, yeah. So we're out here, and this is actually Nobu. So shout out to Deuce Fan. Um, I actually tried Nobu for the first time. If you guys don't know what it is, uh, uh pretty premium <laughs> sushi place, you know. So um, yeah. So if you guys want to look, look, look in the back. It looks super nice. It's super nice here in Beverly Hills. But yeah, I had a good time here. And uh, it's probably my night, so I'll see you guys probably like tomorrow, you know? So, peace. Yo, what up guys? So I'm in my room. It's like 2 o'clock in the morning. I'm super tired. It was a really, really long day. And a lot, a lot of driving. It literally took us like 2 hours just to get there because of LA traffic. Amazing traffic, you know? But it was an amazing day. Um, but shout out to all the brands, you know what I'm saying? Anyways, alright, so here are the Alexander Wang basketballs. And it doesn't even have a box, it comes like in a bag. It says 24 hour Wang energy mass games. I don't know what the fuck, but you know, so I really don't like these too much, but it was like a, a nice resale thing, but I feel like the resale sucks now. I like I saw it for like fifteen hundred, but then went down to like four hundred <laughs> after I got these. So I don't know. We'll see about that. But there's the wings. There's the KT threes from Anta. So we got these. And then I'm working on a little uh, Joshua Vides uh, custom right now. I really love how these look, man. Got to do some touch ups and stuff, but you know I really like these. So there's that. I got my PG2s, of course. I think you guys already saw these. And then I got my Jordan 3 uh, free throw lines. And then my Royal Blue. Um, no, Royal Game. I, I forgot the color name, but it's blue. So shout out to Jordan Brand for those. And of course, as you guys saw from the beginning of the video, I got my uh, 11, Space Jam 11. Why do they put so much shit in the box though? I don't know. I got my Space Jam 11s right here. Oh, that's nice. I got those. You already know, man. I mean. I got the Deserets. Forgot what the colorway is called. I think it's blush. It's Addy Preen Plus, which is. I hate Addy Preen Plus. Um, how's it look? It looks pretty hideous. Um, but, you know, I'm gonna do a review on them and stuff. Uh, how does it smell though? It doesn't smell too good. 
But there's that. Got the Yeezys right there. Dude, I'm so happy about this cop, man. Oh my god, these are so sick. And look, it's like it's like pretty soft if you look at it. Like I can like um press it pretty easily here, especially in the heel. It's a lot more expanded, so you can press it. But then here in like the midfoot, it's a lot stiffer, you know. It's not there's a lot more material that's like com compacted more, so I'm really excited to try these out. Um so there's that. I mean, the primate looks insane too. But, you know, that's so dope, man. It's a little hard in volume too, guys. You know, I'm just gonna play in these. You know, these aren't really going for much. And, you know, I gotta test out the hardens anyway, so. I kind of like this colorway, though. I like this, like, lime green kind of color. And I like this little, you know, pattern here. Um, hopefully the traction is good, but I, he I keep hearing that it's not that good, so. I just uh, a little harden right there. I got some Ultra Boost Parlay mids. So this is really dope. I really don't like the mids that Adidas recently, uh, you know, um, have been putting out. But this is the original mid that uh, Adidas had with like, um, was it I think Kith or something like the multicolor one. Uh, but yeah, these are really clean. This Parlay with their plastic, you know, triple white. I don't really like the mesh though. It's like a, it's like a mesh. It feels like, or not really. It's not like as nice as like the uh, original uh, Ultra Boost Prime, you know. But, oh, but I, I kind of like these. Then here's my last cop. Ooh. So I mean, there's no wax paper in here for some reason, but the box is interesting. It's like Adidas and it says Boost. Feet you wear, but boost, you know, boost you wear. But, so, here it is. And I already, like, kind of uh, tried these out, and they're actually pretty nice. They feel a lot different than um, these. You know, like, right here, this is actually, like, there's plastic right here for a heel counter. Um, the materials are a lot stiffer. But then here, there's, like, nothing. So obviously this is more for casual use, but um, I'm excited to play in these, so review will be coming soon, but anyways, it was All-Star Weekend, um, it was an amazing week, really busy, you know, really, really busy, but shout out to all the brands, you know, for inviting us, had a really good time, and um, so yeah, that's it, hope you guys enjoyed the vlog, tomorrow is Donnie Boy's birthday, so I'm not sure what we're going to do. Um, he's more of a last minute guy. He's probably going to be like, oh, let's go eat here. And then I'm probably just going to go. So, um, But yeah, so we'll vlog that too tomorrow. So yeah, we'll see you guys. I'll see you guys tomorrow.